what would you have said if I'd have asked you to take some photo? Do you love me? my channel now you're probably thinking Anna why are you surrounded by balloons well today's video is going to be my 500k special and as you can see by the title I'm actually going to be surprising my mum and my little brother with their holiday of a lifetime and I'm taking them to Disneyland I have wanted to do this for my family for so so long my little brother is four years old his dream is to go to Disneyland he talks about it all the time and my mum just simply can't afford it and thanks to you YouTube and thanks to you guys watching my videos I've managed to save up and book to take my family away to Disneyland for five days next year and I'm going to be surprising them with this trip in this video the reason I've got loads of balloons is because that's part of the trail because you know of course it would be amazing just to hand them the ticket but I'm a youtuber it's not that simple. I have actually lied to my mum today in order to get her out of the house which is you know sorry and i'm going to be setting up a little trail around the house which they are going to have to follow in order to find these tickets so this video is going to be all the preparation them following the trail and then them being surprised at the end i really hope you guys enjoyed this video this video is all down to you watching every single person watching has made this possible so thank you so much from the bottom of my heart you truly truly have changed my life and when i told you guys the content was going to get better i did not lie without further ado i hope you guys enjoy and let's just get straight on into the video oh my god this is actually happening i'm looking at the I'm in Primark and look at all the Disney stuff that they've got. Oh my god, literally, this has just made me 10 times more excited. I've got my mum a Minnie Mouse gift bag and Atticus a Mickey Mouse gift bag. Like, what? Look at the little purses. I really want to get Atticus this. How cute is that? I successfully got everything that I needed in Primark. Fun fact, my mum is actually in there as well. I'm actually parked next to her car, so I was literally running around Primark trying to avoid her getting stuff that she doesn't even know I'm getting. Um, um, for us to go to Disneyland. Now that I've gotten all the bits from Primark and I've sorted out like the bags to give them at the end, it is 10 times more exciting. And even though I've got to wait a fair few days to tell them that we're going, I literally am just buzzing off the walls. And my mum and Atticus have wanted to go for so long. And it was literally last night at the dinner table, mum was saying to me that Atticus has seen an advert for Disneyland on the TV and he kept asking mum all day if we could go. And just the fact that I know that we're going and I've managed to do this for my family because of you guys, is insane i'm just i'm um, just wow i literally am speechless now obviously i don't want mum to find the stuff and because my house is so small you know my mum will go into my room so i'm gonna leave everything that i've bought i also just bought atticus like a little doll at tesco so i'm gonna leave everything in the car until i'm ready to bring it in my mum's not home yet but i just don't want to risk it oh my god how exciting the boarding pass that i ordered to put in the last envelope has arrived and i'm so excited it says boarding pass it's got the disney and it says disney airways and i just opened my other parcel and all of the balloons have arrived that i've ordered you guys will see what i'm going to need them for but i'm going to go put these in my car just so mum literally has no idea that i have them i don't want them to be anywhere in this house i just need to keep them in the car The last two items have arrived. I've got my Disney confetti and then I've got my golden envelopes. I just realised I don't actually have any paper to put in the envelope, so that's a really nice one. Might have to run to Tesco. But other than that, everything is here. I have just sat and I've done all five of the clues ready for tomorrow. I just need to get a black sharpie so I can number them on the front and then obviously I can just lay them about where I need to in the morning. My mum thinks I'm filming a truth or dare video tomorrow, so I've just had to quickly write down 10 dares that I just got from Google to go and show her that she thinks that I'm going to be doing tomorrow while she's out just because she doesn't actually believe me she thinks there's something fishy going on well she's right hence the envelopes but I need to show her this just as a little bit of proof just so she actually believes that these are the dares that I'm going to be doing mum these are the dares I'm doing tomorrow okay prank call girlfriend to break up 
I'm in my car because basically I had all of the stuff that I bought earlier on in the week from Primark in my boot and because mum and Atticus are having a late night because obviously Atticus has been at school all week and it's a Friday so mum's letting him have a night off well a late night not a night off I've had to come and sit in my car I've had to say that I'm going to Tesco and I'm gonna have to sit and do the bags in here so that's what I'm gonna do now I've got the big Primark bag here filled with everything so fully pulled up at Tesco at this time just so I can sit comfortably and do the Primark bags like this is dedication okay so this is my mum's bag I've got her the Minnie Mouse one and inside I've got her some Minnie Mouse socks I got a little Minnie Mouse purse to use when we go she's got a t-shirt in there and then she's also got a face mask which has got a bell on it I got her bell because Atticus will be very excited about that so that is mum's little bag which I'm going to give her obviously when she's found out that we're going to Disney and then this is Atticus's and inside he's got a throw which I need to take the price off but it's got Mrs Potts on because that's his favourite from Beauty and the Beast and then I got him a little Mickey Mouse wallet purse thing. He will love that for when we go to Disney. I got him a little doll of Belle because he loves Belle. It's his like mini toddler Belle. I didn't really realise it was, but apparently it is. And then I also got him a little mini mouse brush because he loves hairbrushes. And then I also got him a Mrs. Potts keyring because he always pretends to have keys like me and mum. So I just got all of this stuff for them. Like it's little surprises and little extra bits that we can all take to Disney when we go. That is all now done and it's currently two minutes past nine. So whilst I'm at Tesco, I feel like I might as well go in and get some food because food and then i'm gonna go home i need to blow up all the balloons but luckily i've said to my mum that the reason i'm coming to tesco is to get balloons and that we're filming a truth or dare with balloons so i can blow up like 25 30 balloons without her even getting suspicious but i've actually got a pack of 100 where are they they're actually here i've been keeping them in my car this whole time so when i walk in with this mum's gonna be like where did you buy that from in tesco like hmm they're, it's then they're new in literally wish me luck i've got to blow up 30 of these now because i told mum that i need 30 balloons for tomorrow and then i've got to blow up 70 in the morning and i don't even think i've got enough like this isn't going to fill the bathroom but it will be enough to annoy my mum but then surprise her so these balloons are absolutely massive i think i've blown up about 15 maybe and it has took me about 15 minutes because i'm literally so out of breath like these balloons compared to my hand are so big so i'm kind of glad that i managed to get bigger ones but by the time i finish my room is literally going to be like up here i have just finished blowing up 72 balloons because in this pile i have got 28 left which means i've managed to blow up 72 and now I'm going to have to go to bed because I can't let my mum see any of these. My mum is still awake. So luckily I've got a lock on my door and I'm literally just going to go straight to bed. And in the morning I'm going to have to keep my door shut because look at this. Like I literally may as well just be pranking myself. Like look at this. Look at this. Good morning everybody. Today is the day and look how I had to sleep last night. Here is the finished room full of balloons. I decided to put them in my room instead just because if they need the toilet before we start, they're going to find all the balloons. So I thought, okay, I'll just keep them in my room. But literally it is full to the brim. I now need to go into here and I need to try and find a balloon to write a number on. So I'm going to write it right down here. If I grab this pastel pink one here. And if I write on it a tiny little number five, oh actually it might rub off, that's right down there and then put all the balloons back on it. I've got 150 pink and white balloons in here and it is literally just overflowing and what they're going to have to do is I've written a number on one of these balloons which is right at the back there and once they've found that number then they were in the trip to Disneyland. So these are the five golden envelopes. So the first one I'm going to go stick on the door and that's what my mum will see when she first walks in. That is hung up on our door. Number two is going to be on the inside of this kitchen cupboard. I wrote in letter number one that it's in the kitchen so they're going to have to open that cupboard to find that. Number three is going to be hidden in Atticus's kitchen so I'm just going to pop this up here. I said it's in the living room so that shouldn't be too hard to find. Number four is going to be hidden in mum's room so I think I'm just going to pop it underneath her pillow because well actually, I actually don't even know if they'll check there but then that makes it a little bit more fun so we'll hide that one there and then number five is going to be on my bedroom door which will be fully shut and then when they open it 
they will see this. The only Disney hint I'm gonna be giving is when they follow the sparkle dust up the stairs, it's gonna be Disney princess, but then mum will think hopefully that I've just done that for Atticus. We've got the castle, we've got crowns, and then we've got Snow White and Cinderella in here, which are two of Atticus's favorites, so he'll love this. This is honestly where mum starts to hate me because I've sprinkled confetti all upstairs, but oh my god it will all be worth it the whole stairs has got the dust going all the way down i don't know whether to put the princess dust in with it just because i really don't want to give it away what it is but yeah there's absolutely loads of it so i forgot that i've also got these two bags that i just had to run and get from inside my car so i think i'm going to put these in my wardrobe and then when they know that we're going to disney i will hand them to them everything is now set up and ready to go i'm so excited my mum probably won't be back for like another hour hour and a half maybe so I've definitely got enough time. I'm just gonna sit. I'm gonna relax and because my mum will be home before Atticus I'm gonna walk outside with the camera and I'm just gonna say sorry There's a surprise. I lied to you blah 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 So the next step you will see will be me surprising my mum with the start of the trail and I'm, I'm so nervous I'm so excited. But I'm so nervous My mum just pulled up at home and Atticus isn't here So I'm gonna have to run outside and it's time to do it. Hello um, basically so I had to lie to you. We didn't actually film a video because we're gonna film the video when Atticus gets home. So you can't actually go in the house yet. Why can't I go in the house? What are you doing? Because you can't, you can't go in yet. Go, you have to go make me a cup of coffee. What are you doing? Okay, I'll, I'll make you a drink and I'll bring it out. What are you doing? You'll have to wait and see. You haven't filmed a video. What are you no. doing? You truthful dead. No. No? Um, no, I lied to you. Because we're filming the video now. It all makes sense now. What? Why you wanted me to come out. But I did say to you, when you first said to me on the phone, you ran me up from Byron's and that, didn't you? Yep. And when you were saying, I said, it's dodgy. <laughs> you wouldn't want me out of the house unless it were dodgy. Do you remember? <laughs> well, too late yeah. now. Why? Because I'm right on the edge. <laughs> no, no, I'll be honest with you. Right, I'm like that little sleep this week. Right. What number's on it? One. Okay, take number one this off. This is a surprise, isn't it, Atticus? <laughs> this is nice. Okay, open number one. Go on then. Next that will be number two. So Clever clue boy, in that's a clue in there. A clue to help us find number two. I can't believe Anna's done this. Did she trick us? Yeah. <laughs> what did you trick us? We... <gasps> Do you want me to Go read on and read number one? one. First of all, I am sorry for lying to you, but it is all for good reason, I promise. She did yeah. lie to us, didn't she? Yeah. Annie, you should have not lied to us. This is the first of many clues which you need to follow. Head into the kitchen to find the first in in the kitchen yeah. now you've got to find clue number two okay you can open the cupboards it might be in a cupboard it's somewhere in the Ask kitchen look. washing machine uh, oh Atticus you were very hot then oh, Atticus, you, were hot, you were hot then you nearly found it where did you just go you went to open that Atticus yeah. oh, maybe <gasps> number two you found the first clue but have you any guesses as to what this is all I'm for <laughs> Oh, she's going to give us a clue in the next one. Turn to the right. Okay. I meant number left. Three. Oops. Yeah, you're right. Give us a clue in number three. Into the living room. And look for the next envelope that might give you another clue. Look for clue number three. It's around three, your Atticus. kitchen area. It's around your kitchen, Atticus, just to help you a little bit. <gasps> Top oh. Shelf. Oh. oh. Open number three. Ah, oh, the third golden envelope. Yet there's still no explanation as to why I'm making you do this. Follow the trail of sparkle, sparkle dust, Let up the stairs again. into your bedroom. Then You're not far now. <gasps> sparkle dust. Right, you need to follow this. <gasps> Let's follow it. Oh. Oh, okay. And now you've got to find the next one. I'd look over by Mummy's bed. This is the final clue. Okay. The next envelope explains everything. P.S. Please don't hate me. We don't know that's that. I never hate you. I'll get it down for you. You open it. Is this the final one? Yeah. <laughs> the last one. Oh, we got clue. Open the door. You need to find the special numbered one. What? That leads to your final prize. Yeah. Again. Sorry. You don't need to say sorry. <gasps> yeah. Oh my god! Oh my gosh! <laughs> oh my god. That's a lot of blues, I know. <laughs> I bet the prize 
did all. I'm that is hell of a lot of balloons, Anna. You've got to find the special numbered balloon. But what, there's one with a number there's on There's one with a number, you've got to dig through them. Go, quick, you've got to find yeah, the numbered three. one. What then? <laughs> you got to find the numbered one. <laughs> oh my God. Oh my God. When did you do this? <laughs> I was up till 4am, so. Oh my God. <laughs> I knew I had you pumping the balloon. I knew I did. I saw it before I had it. Oh my god! It's got three. It's got three. It's got three little numbers on it. Three little numbers. <laughs> Come on, Mum! Come on! Oh, oh. Attic, this is hard going. This is a lot of balloons down there. There's 150 balloons here. Yeah, it was in that corner, but you've smushed them all about, oh, no. so. I think I've a number. Have you got it? Yeah. Has it got drawing on with the sharp? That's it, that's it, that's it. Okay. Five, five, five. They were just okay. random numbers. <laughs> what? Is that it? That was it. Okay, I'll see something. Is that it? I'm joking. There you go. Oh, What is it? Guess where we're all going. Where? Disneyland. Disneyland? Disneyland. Yeah. <laughs> we're so happy. She's got a ticket for us for Disneyland. We're going to Disneyland for five days. Every single bit of food is paid for. We're going to go, we're staying in Hotel Shem, which is all Toy Story themed. <gasps> and we've got the top room with Woody. And we're having character breakfast with, no, Be with, with Belle and Beast. No! We're having character breakfast with Belle and Beast. Where's he going? Where's he going? Oh my god! Oh. Actually, we're going to breakfast with Belle and we're going to see the Disney no, World. You got that? Yeah, we're going to see the Disney World West show on one of the nights. And we've got full board dining, so every single bit of You've food got is paid for. From Belle and Beast. Yeah. Anna, your sister is paid for Anna, you and me. We're gonna go on a plane. Plane? Plane or train? Plane or train. I, I hope it's a train. Yeah to fly to Disneyland where all of the prince and princesses live. Will we see Peter Pan and the Hulk? Yeah, you're going to see everyone. Everybody. Oh my gosh. And just to go with us. Oh my god. <laughs> Hang on. I got you a present each in the meantime. So Atticus, that's your Mickey Mouse bag. Oh my god. And then you've got a Minnie Mouse bag. When did you do this? Uh, on the fly. <laughs> Where, where, should we open yes, it? Yeah, open it. Top. And you can take it all to Disney. Oh, you've got loads in there. Anna, I can't believe you've done this. You've got a... Uh, oh, look. Mrs. Uh, Potts blanket Mrs. to Potts take. Blanket. I saw this in Tesco. Oh, you got a little God, baby bell. bell. I saw this in Tesco. <laughs> Anna, you've got loads in there. Anna, I can't believe you've done this. What did you get? A Mickey brush. You got, you got a little mini brush. Got a Mickey wallet. You got a Mickey wallet I to take with you. Money in. Yeah. Where are we going? Well, I, I'm, I'm, you bought me. A, I didn't buy none of this. I didn't. Buy but, I bought all of this. Anna, Anna, good job for Mickey. You bought it all. Since, since mummy's. Um, Go on then, open yours. You got, you got I don't know. Open yours. Put everything in your bag. I can't believe it, that is special. You have to keep that. That, yeah. Oh, she got all my god. Oh, I've got a True Love's Kiss face mask. We've got sleeves and booty. Yeah. True Love's Kiss. A new sleeves oh, and booty. This is wicked. Mum, look what you got, a sleeves and booty one. Oh, oh, oh. Oh. Little mini Maybe socks to take. Good job, Mummy. That's why you wear clothes. Oh, I got a mini! <laughs> a mini one? You got a mini, you got a mini purse you to take. wallet. Oh. <laughs> and you got a t-shirt to take as well. Listen. Oh, I'll get you a Mickey one before we go. You can wear a Mickey one. You can wear all Mickey. And this time you're going to remember it all. It's a perfect page. <laughs> and I thank you so, so, so. I can't even thank you enough. I can't, I can't believe it. Mum, I can't believe it. Mom, I'm hoping that... You'll be adding your toys to the Belle and Beast. Toys? Or whatever. What, 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 what,
You're gonna see me and uh, uh, Gaston. And Gaston. And, but, and you're gonna meet them all. Guess Woody, Jesse. Guess what? If Gaston can't kill the beast, I would be happy. Atticus, do you understand that you know the Disneyland advert that you saw? That's yeah, where you're going. Yeah, you know Atticus, you know the advert, and you keep saying to Mummy, can we go, can we go? And Mummy's been saying, when well, Mummy's got more pennies, haven't I? Yeah. Because it costs so much money. Anastasia has booked it and she paid for it before. That's where we're going. Yeah. Oh my god. Oh, I can't believe it. Yeah, taking you to Disneyland. You can't believe it. I think you're just in a bit of a shock, aren't you? I can't believe it. We're going to get Mickey and Minnie here somewhere. Yeah. Woo! We're going to Disney! Daddy! Look what we got! I can't believe it and I'm really happy. We're going to Disney World. That's because we got matching purses. Guess what? I'm going to wear a Mickey top as well. Yeah. Get you. yeah. You've got yeah. Mrs. Potts blanket. Did she trick us good? We yeah. thought she was doing a video with Doyle, Deb, and Tanisha. What and Amber. And Mom, I thought, Mom, I'm going to come home to me. She's dead. the best the world <laughs> <laughs> Oh my god, I hope you guys enjoyed it. I surprised my family with a trip to Disneyland and I'm just like, what? Get ready for the Disney vlogs. They are going to be something else. I am so truly excited and I hope you guys are too. I love you so, so, so much. Thank you so much for half a million subscribers. Next milestone, a million. We're gonna do it and no matter how long it takes us, we're gonna do it. And I love you all so, so, so much and I will see you on Wednesday at 6pm for a brand new video. Bye!